you doing? This is Fee, Dummy in the Rough. And I'm going down a totally different rabbit hole to everybody else. So I've seen the rabbit hole that people climbing into is called floss tube. <laughs> I'm not a floss tube person. I, uh, yeah, I can't do, well, I don't think I could do floss tube. Not trying. I tried beaded cross stitch. I've got one. It's taking me forever. Um, so I've gone down a different rabbit hole. So I've got the diamond painting rabbit hole. I've got the, let's put it, resin rabbit hole. And now I'm going to go through down this rabbit hole. So you may, you will see this unboxing is going to go on my new channel which is uh, I've created just for planning side of things. But what will happen on the planning side of things is I will use the planner to schedule and plan my YouTube videos for Diamond in the Rough and my other channel, which is Plan with Fee. Hopefully that goes right. Plan with Fee sounds good to me. Even that rhymes. Okay, so I... Went down the rabbit hole of Erin Condren. Um, yeah, I've got this order arrived today. I've got two more orders. One has shipped. I've got another one processing, and I'm filling up my cart with a little bit more. So, if you guys are interested in any of this stuff, there will be a link below which will have the affiliate link where you will get um, I, I believe you get a discount at this stage I'm so new I know you will get a discount and I'll get a little bit from it which doesn't add on to uh, what you purchase uh, I will also not just put the links down for Erin Condren but I will give put down the exact name of what these are uh, with the unboxing of these so that you know exactly what it is that's coming out of these boxes you will see that this is only on one uh, you will only see this one box opened up on diamond in the rough everything else is going to be opened up on um Plan with fame so the rabbit hole starts here i'm opening up my very first uh planner and this is an Erin Condren planner. So this, uh, I will put the links down below if anybody is interested in joining me in this little rabbit hole for all of the stuff, for, for an affiliate link for Erin Condren. And I also will list in by name what it is that I unbox. Let's get started. And I did cut the seal off and... Um, here we go. This is the welcome pack. I'll try and get this to sit nicely. And uh, for those that are not aware, I have a puppy dog. I have a four-legged fur baby. Here you will hear. Clip popping all over the place. Anyway, uh, you will learn that I waffle on a bit. So what we have here is the welcome pack. First thing you notice in the box, apart from the fact that it's beautiful, it's a beautiful box to come in, is their welcome pack. So what you get is hello and welcome. Thanks for your first order. Simplify and stylize gift giving on the go with this complimentary set of of signature labels. Enjoy these three gifts, three free gift labels. So some labels there. Um, and on the back, it tells you to be how to become an EC insider, which is um, basically providing you guys with a link so that if you're interested, you can purchase through it. The labels, okay, enjoy with love and happy day. And two of the bigger ones, just a little something from, and happy birthday. So cute little welcome pack. And under the wrapping, look at this. How 
put his out. So I'm going to take this out of the box. What I'm going to show you is I've lifted this straight out of the box. So this is how well packaged these are. There is the tissue paper. And at the very bottom, yep, is an airbag for extra protection. Okay. Throw that one. This here is the planner. Do I open that up first? Or do I go through everything else? Nah, open this one up first. So the planner itself, and I do have them listed down here so that I can tell you exactly what they're called. So this one is the Layers Neutral Life Planner Binder. Um, I have the Rose Gold Foil. Uh, the interior design is Layers Neutral and a Vertical. And I had it personalised. Now, I've got a few other things on the way that I've had personalised because I want to try different ways, but my personalisation is just fee. So this one, I do have Diamond in the Rough and I do have fee Diamond in the Rough. So let's see what happens. Okay, take this out. I'm trying not to show you what's underneath. And that one's gone. So the planner. Oh wow. Okay, so the planner is I need to put it all in. Uh, we'll do that as a setup. But what we do have in here is welcome to the Condren family. Little note there, so I'll open this one up. Oh, how cute. How cute is this? I have had diaries and kind of planners, but they've not lasted very long. So I'm hoping that um, I'll be all good this time. <laughs> I know with what I've spent on these, I reckon I should be. So this is uh, welcome to the Erin Condren family. Enjoy gifts. So circle label, customize your circle label for your life planner. So that can go on the end. Okay, then we have Oops. Then we have the, so I'll put that one there. Complimentary cards. Spread positivity with this sampling of thoughtful compliment cards featuring motivating sayings. There is a full set of 10 cards, but you lift me up. I'm so proud of you. Your potential is endless. Oh, I do like those. Compliment cards. Gift labels, a little something from. Enjoy. Okay, they're cute. And friends and family discount cards. Enjoy 20% off your next purchase or share with friends and family. So I actually, there's actually two coupons on the back of that one. I won't cover the, I'll cover those. So shop away. Please enjoy 20% off your next purchase. That's going to be handy for that one that I've got in the the order that I've got in the car. Okay, so that's the welcome pack and the planner. And I will do a setup with this planner while I put this away, when I put this away. But add your folder and sticker sheet starting from the second hole from the top and ending with the second hole from the bottom. So we've got the holes you can see there. Open and close your eight ring binder from the four centre rings. A one section, a one monthly section into your binder at a time, and evenly distribute pages on both sides of your binder rings before closing, and finish adding your folder and sticker sheets in at the second last hole. Okay, so that one there. Stay tuned for this one. I will. I think I'll put this together. I won't do much with it, but I'll put this together in this video. Okay, so that's the planner. Next, I suppose I will just go with that one. Now that one's just the grey um, what they called? Grey pen holder. Just goes to the attaches on the um, inside and it will hold my pen inside the planner and hold it. So 
let's have a look at this one. So 3M scotch tape to hang off, this is fly. There we go. It's still you'll see really is just the um, bit the pen goes into. Okay, so next. So sorry, I'll go through the planner that I got with the rose gold foil. I got uh, the gold uh, binder. That cost $55. That's with the personalization. The grey pen holder. That was only $3.50. This one here is the one that looks uh, exciting. So this is the designer gel pens bundle. The three in one bundle was $21. Now, if you've seen uh, me as Diamond in the Rough, and you've seen some of my written chats that I've done, um, and some of the things I've done, I mentioned being a train controller. Train controllers use black, purple, blue, green, orange, and red. Um, and it's very hard to get a set of the one of all six colours. I managed to get a set of five, all I need is a red pen. Let's see, I don't think I've got, no, I haven't got reds. But, so these are $21. So we've got in here, they do have the colours red, jade, navy, purple, and black. Oh, it is a red. Then we have the neons, which is uh, neon pink, neon orange, neon yellow. And then we have peony, orange, green, turquoise, and lavender. So I will grab the orange from there, and that is actually a red. It just didn't look like a, well, to me, it doesn't look red, but it is a red. So they, that set of three, and I'm going to bust one out. I will pull out the red. Look at how pretty that is. It's the circles, I think they call them. Okay. The test of it for me is actually writing on here. I think I've just got to get it started first. Okay. Oh, they're nice. These do have, I think I recall these were a 0.38 millimetre, which um, a thin pen, which is real, which is what I really love for my job. So that one's probably going to get lost in my work stuff. So that's set of three. Now, we'll go through this one. Oh, I like the packaging for that. So these are the dual tip colourful markers. And 15.50. Oh, sealed. Of course it's sealed. Not a, not a hard seal, just a peel. And sticky stuff. The same for the other side. Ouch. I hate sticky stuff. <laughs> I work with resin, but I hate sticky tape. <laughs> okay, so there is actually a. That's a fairly firm hold. I've had to get that a fairly good pull. So the coloured markers, so 1550. I will grab my. So these are supposed to be dual tip markers. So we'll have a. Come on, we'll go for a pretty, pretty. The pale pink. So. Bubble gum, lemon, turquoise, sea foam, orchid, and grey. I might actually go there, for orchid, because I do like those colours. So one side is a fine, the other one is an ultra fine. <laughs> okay, so yet again I'm going to scribble. Oh, I like that. Okay, bring it up. So you see the difference? <laughs> messy difference, messy scribbles. But I do like them. 
Very nice, very nice. Okay, then on top here we have what they call the Planny Pack. Layers Neutral Planny Pack. So, we shall open this up. This is where, let the last one out, you get rid of that. That's on the card. So this, they do have a little motivational things here. Plan for tomorrow, celebrate today. I'm going to unzip this. Oh, I do like that. That's pretty. Oh, that's a really solid. That's really thick and, oh, that's really good. So it is a vinyl. But what you do with the planning pack you can on the outside but I believe on the inside too I'll show you on the inside first you will always have your planner pens in there that is cool on the inside on the outside um, and I do believe I can probably put it all the way around to fold everything together just that little bit more so that is the plenty pack which was $20 now I am talking in US dollars here the next one is this is cool this is so cool sticky notes this is one of the ones that I'm really looking forward to opening up is the sticky notes so this is a snap, snap in stylized sticky notes so this was $10.50. Okay, take that out. So what happens is there's eight pads, 20 repositional adhesive notes. There's 160 sticky notes in here. Actually, when I put it together, but basically they snap into the um, clips on the inside of the, uh, the coils. So when I put this together, you'll see this working. Okay, so that was that. How cool. That was the kaleidoscope. So that is another one that they call. This is the layers neutral. This is kaleidoscope. Um, yeah, this is so cool. Next, sitting on top is the, I've got a warning, make sure I get it called right, the right thing. This is the layers snap in to do list and two, three, I can't see the price on that one. That's cut, been cut off on my printing, on my, when I printed it. Okay, hang on. Let's get this open. Open. So this is a snap-in dashboard. So you use the wet and dry markers. I do believe. Hang on. This is going to tell it. Um, That's a whiteboard marker, so let's see if I can manage to tool it. <laughs> so what you can do with the wet dry erasers, wet dry pens, you can actually wipe that off. I will probably need to give that a bit more of a wipe because I use whiteboard marker. And that yet again clips into the foils. Okay. Then we have, still have that one to go, the Layers Neutral Assorted Life Planner Sticker Pack. So this sticker pack was $8.50. Okay. Squeeze that out and so there's just a uh, 
just a simple sticker pack. Oh, look at these. Today, this week, to do, rescheduled, cancelled. <laughs> There's all the birthday cakes, happy birthday, celebrate, let's party. One, two, four stickers. And this one here, I'll only lift up slightly, you can see these are just the skinny little bars and these will go across um, the vertical planner. And the last one on this list is the Bill Tracker Dashboard. So this is one that will go in the budget side of things for me because one of the things I've, I've got another one another planner coming but I'm going to use it for my for budget or not quite budget but but it is kind of budget because I don't know how to budget I can't budget I just see something I buy it now um, yeah terrible like that oh savings tracker <laughs> might be down here <laughs> but this is the monthly bills um, so that I can keep track of what bills uh, every month and my quarterly bills. And that is a snap-in and it is obviously the one that you write on. So all in all, all of this stuff that I brought, all of this product, I got subtotal was 152 of all of this stuff. Uh, and you look at it, there's... I will need to continue to buy stickers. I will need to get a new planner for the next year. But most of this is, I can use this year after year because I can write on it and wipe it off as required. Um, but I did get some discounts off of it and it cost me, including the freight, I do believe, I'll just have a quick look. Yes, including the freight, um, 165 US. So that was over 200 Aussie dollars. I think it worked out 220, 240, somewhere, somewhere around there. Hence why I say I don't track my budget. Um, but what will happen, I will say budget-wise with my other planner that I've got ordered is um, I'll track what I have ordered, how much I've spent, and also I want it to track uh, delivery and what I, when I'm expecting something, when it's been shipped. Okay, so now what I'm going to do, I'm going to put this together. Uh, I will speed through putting it together, but uh, let's watch this process. So we've got this in, I'll put everything else that I want to do in here as well. But first things first, I am going to put my name on the front here. So I wasn't quite sure what sizing I'd go with. So I didn't know whether I wanted to do Diamond in the Rough or Fee Diamond in the Rough. I might put Fee Diamond in the rough there, I think. Uh, now, for the planner side of the community, I don't know whether you've seen these, but I have a label maker. It's a very easy label maker. It's called the Xyron. I use it with um, labeling and stuff for diamond painting. But all you do, and you try and hold it straight, And instead of having to glue down, this actually puts the glue on the back. Okay. So there it is there, more sticky stuff. 
And all I need to do is pull this up and I've got glue on the back of that. And this is actually repositionable tape. I'm going to put this in line there and that is now stuck down. I have shocking writing. Hang on. Oh, I'll leave it at this is. I have shocking handwriting, so therefore I will always try and print out um, my name. Okay. Uh, okay, so I will put my phone number in there, but not at the moment because I don't want anybody ringing me. Next to we look at is, as we open that, open this up, have enough courage to start and enough heart to finish. This is the 18 month calendar, which is going to be handy for me. Um, we've got holidays in June, July, August uh, next year. So provided everything goes well and we're able to travel, uh, we are traveling within our state. Okay, so that's uh, the 18 month calendar. I've seen people do these, uh, the new beginnings, new mindset, new focus, new start, new intentions, new results. I've seen various ways that people do these. Um, these are month by month basis. The best layout, well you don't have to, but the best layout I've seen is go by quarters, which is basically January, February, March, April, May, June, July, August, September, October, November, December. It keeps it nice and neat. I've seen January, February, March, April, not quite right. And then you've got the other side going along. But yeah, by the quarter is the way I will be doing this. Still working out what I'm gonna put there. And a notes page, find the beauty in every day. So we open up to July. So this gives us the month. And I have seen people change these top labels, which is something I'm going to have to do. Because one of the things I'm going to do here is actually put my roster on here. So I do day shift and I do shift work. And at the pattern of our roster, if I change this from to Monday to Sunday, the pattern flows and you can really see it flows. Okay, the next page we turn over. Okay, so this here, July 2020. So this is your notes for what you probably expect to do. Um, bullet points of things you want to achieve. Could put birthdays. Yet again, for me, I wasn't being, I wasn't completely set on how I was going to do certain things because until I actually had it in my hands and had physically had it here and I could touch and feel it, um, it was all just wait and see. And then we go to the week, so vertical days. And this is perfect for Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday. This is how um, I want the monthly one to be. Meh. Um, my roster, I do two days, two nights, then I do two days, three nights, and then I do three nights, sorry, three days, two nights. So it's a pattern for our roster. So these days have already happened because today is the 7th of July. Okay, so we go through, we have all the months in here, different little sayings. Do it with all your heart. I love this. These are gorgeous. Good things are coming. Keep believing. And there's a notes page when you get to each part, at the back of each one, you have a notes page. Um, you are what you manifest. Okay, so we go to further back here, December. And it ends on... Second, January the 2nd, 2022. Wow. Radio. Then you have notes pages. Okay. Contacts. Now, 
I've seen people get there going, well, I've got all my phone numbers I mean, in, my, in my phone. I have had numerous occasions where I haven't been able to get my phone. One, I've left, I've left my phone at work on my last day of shift and come, and then the first day of shift is four days later. Um, and all my numbers are stuck in my phone. You know, so this is going to be handy. I have had, I've had my phone stolen. So this is handy because you can put your emergency people that you need to talk to, need to contact here so that if you happen to lose your phone in any way, shape or form, you have your contacts. Because now that we save our numbers, our, our contacts in our phones, how many can remember phone numbers? My partner's number, I can never remember the last three digits of his phone. I can remember the first lot of mobile, the first lot of numbers for his mobile phone, but I can never remember the last three. Don't know what it is. The only phone number, the two phone numbers I can remember, one is my number, the other is my mum's mobile. You never forget your mother's mobile. <laughs> or you try not to. Okay, and this is forward planning for 2022. And in the back, a strong foundation is built on infinite layers. Wow. So there is already stickers in there, which is actually the same sticker pack that I have here. Uh, this just is, isn't clamped in, um, clamped in. So if we look at the pack that I got, just means that I've got more of them. So that one, so that's the same. Today, or the birthday celebrates, and then the labels, which is pretty cool to have. Then you have a folder for your stickers. Now, I don't believe, yes, no, these won't, these won't fit in there. Um, I've seen other people open up theirs and they have the perpetual calendar in there. I'll have to send an email and find out. Okay, um, these stickers do not fit. So, which is why when you buy it, they fit. Okay. What I will need to do is get, um, they do have sticky corners so I can get what's basically this. You can stick on the corner for your stickers. But what I do want to do, I need to work out where I'm going to put things. This one here, I'd probably put in, probably I'd put it in July. It's pretty well central and pen will go in there. But it will go, I will put it onto one of the tabs. And I think because it's the beginning of the next year, financial year, uh, this is probably the perfect spot to put it. Okay. Now, where did I put that? I'll put this all together. Where did I put it? Can't see it. Hang on. I will find it. There it is. Okay. So this is your... We'll pop that into the page that uh, the, we should be on. So that has inches in measurement. Mm. And I'll just pop these on. That holds pretty firmly. So that is that one there. I will pop these just simply on here and I'm starting to see how bulked up this is already so these actually clip in I'm just trying to get them to clip in Hang on. when you have the, the coiled ones these fit the coils as well okay So what's going to happen, I may have too many things hooked into this, I am going to have to take out um, 
some months. So bear with me. <laughs> mm. Definitely need to take out some months, don't I? Didn't get that in there quite right. There we go. How about I just take that out and leave it out for now? There we go. I will actually, June. Okay, what I'm going to do is remove June to December. Okay. And take all of June and this, July to December out. Leaving just at the notes page. Okay. I'm going to put those in the, um, I'll wrap those back up in paper and put them in that box to store them. So that means that what I will do is pop that on the notes page, I think. We'll see. Still working on that one. That's better. Now I can turn these. Instead of clipping one, I'll just pop these on like this. Um, just trying to work out the best spot for these. If I go to the monthly calendar, I might put that in the one behind the monthly and in the Ah, might as well open it up. Okay. In the date, I won't put that one, I will take that one out. And I will pop that one in there. That will be my page okay gosh that's tight hang on I might put it in that one Let's see how that goes that is very tough okay mm, okay not too sure on that one in there. Um, these, this is better. This is soft. That they are very firm. They click, click in very easy. Uh, so they are the sticky notes. Radio. So I will close this up. And one of the things I have noticed. That priorities one, that's actually giving me grief. Okay, should I open it up there? That priorities is just giving me grief. Now, one of the things I have watched other people with is not being able to shut these properly. So what happens is they that curves. There is something called page lifters. So there, I will be looking into page lifters. I will pop that. Just pop that in there so I know we no one. Okay, so let's close this up. I'm just wondering whether that's how you do it. Close this up. The planning pack. Oops. There you go. The planning pack will actually hold that together. Okay, so there we go. This one is all unboxed, kind of set up ready for me to start putting stuff in and um, for, for me to start planning. I will leave that there. I will pop some beautiful little sayings. I love plan for tomorrow, celebrate today. So what do you think? Am I going to have fun setting this up? Am I going to have fun with stickers? I do have some stickers already that I purchased from, I will say, Officeworks, which is our stationery. 
but I have also purchased from this GP Studio. Now the GP Studio is actually on Etsy. Um, I will put the link down here, down below, but she's on Etsy, but she is also Western Australian. So if you actually want to my subscribe, my, my gems that have watched either of these, and you are in Western Australia, um, yeah, West Australian, so you go, she's actually in Como. Um, but I've got other stickers, but I'll go through those at a later stage. I'll do a sticker haul when I've got a few more stickers. And um, hopefully you enjoyed that. What big rabbit hole have I fallen into? We don't have, well, we do, we have rabbit holes in Australia, but we also have wombat burrows. I think I've gone in a wombat burrow. Um, guys, comments. What do you think? Would you be interested? Um, if uh, what I will do is put the link, I will put the subscribe button on here somewhere for Plan With Fee. And if, it's, if you're watching this in Plan With Fee, I will give you the, the subscribe button for Fee Diamond in the Rough, which is the craft side of things. So you can go and check me out there as well. I'm an Australian, West Australian, um, proudly so. And uh, guys, give me a thumbs up or a thumbs down. Any comments? What do you think? And if you are just dropping by, uh, hit the subscribe button and the bell so you're notified when I do uh, upload a video. And uh, yeah, we'll go from there. And I will say bye for now.